Whenever the winds blow hard, the blowhards blow in, bringing us Category 5 hyperbole. We are eye to eye with Isabel. But nary a whisper of real news. It's pelting my face and it hurts. <laughs> They seem not so much interested in getting the story. Here comes a big wave, get ready. As they are getting washed out to sea. One of the biggest concerns emergency management officials had was beach erosion. Go, 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 go. And it gets worse every year as reporters edge closer and closer to harm's way. Geraldo Rivera is live on the seawall there. Last week, we almost lost Geraldo Rivera. Right, wait, what's going on? Oh, well. Whoa. Maybe next time. Are you okay? Point is, whenever reporters get up to their knees in a hurricane... I saw these teenagers diving into the street. Not a good idea. They're also up to their necks in hypocrisy. You know what? We talk about diving into the street, and I just did it myself. Some say we help bring on this nonsense. The wind doesn't get much worse than it is right here. After Dan Rather co-anchored with a telephone pole back in 95, just about every reporter in America started flirting with natural disaster. Yeah, our light just blew over. Even so I once like tried doing the dramatic the weather live shot. I darn near electrocuted myself. Sorry about that, folks. Um. <laughs> Other reporters have been hit by debris. So far, no serious injuries, but it's only a matter of time, according to Harold Dow. Standing out in the middle of a hurricane when everybody knows it's dangerous doesn't make any sense to me. Harold is a CBS News correspondent. He covered Hurricane Gloria 23 years ago. Kind of covered it. They had a picture window showing the beach, and I just actually stood in front of that and did, and did my stand-up. So you never left the hotel room? Right. <laughs> CBS management never asked him to cover another hurricane after that. Of course, most reporters like covering hurricanes and will no doubt continue to relish the assignment, no matter how bad the wind or the rain. Let's see if we can uh, talk to these guys here. Or the embarrassment. Why don't you guys take some shelter? Don't you see there's a hurricane coming? <laughs> oh, we can see it. I wanted to show you Harold's on camera in front of the picture window, but Katie, it has mysteriously disappeared from the CBS archives. Wow, that was harsh, Steve. Gosh. Yeah, I looked for a video of you. I didn't find any. You, you know, ever I, do that? I went to the Harold Dow School of Journalism. Did you? Okay, actually, yeah. yes. Me too.